Vicky on TV. Kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn the bell notification on. So anytime we upload new video onto YouTube, you will be notified. Thank you. Today, uh, we are here setting a legislative agenda for the 9th National Assembly. A call on the Senate to broaden the search for a credible Senate president within the Northeast. This text of a World Press Conference by Partner for Legislative Agenda for Nigeria, a coalition of civil society and youth groups in Nigeria on March 27, 2019, here in Abuja. Gentlemen of the press, sequel to the recent concluded presidential and legislative elections, it becomes imperative to begin a serious agenda setting for the Nine National Assembly, starting from the leadership of the Senate. The Senate President is the Chairman of the National Assembly, and is very critical to the direction the country goes. We are concerned about the need to avoid the unnecessary rancorous politicking that led to the emergence of Senator Abubakar Bukola Saraki, that was in 2015, and the subsequent psychological and physical combat that follows. This issue, as we all know, affected governance negatively. Our major intention is to create an harmonious executive-legislative relationship that will help the country achieve sound and effective governance. Gentlemen of the press, the history of leadership of the National Assembly needs to be placed in its proper perspective to reduce tension and help the leadership selection process in the Ninth National Assembly. That is about setting the record straight. In 1999, when this democracy was baited, the President, General Lushogo Abbasanjo, was from the South. The Southwest, to be precise, why the Senate president was in the South, also the Southeast specifically. This was the arrangement for the two term eight years of Abbas and George presidency. Similarly, in 2007, when the late Umar Musa Yaradwa from the Northwest became president, the Senate president moved from the South to the North, this time the North Central, and was held by Senator David Mack who served the longest term as Senate President in Nigeria. Unfortunately, Yaradua died and his deputy, Dr. Gulok Ebele Jonathan, became President. The Senate President was, ret was retained in the North Central simply because it was understood that President Jonathan was continuing with President Yaradua's tenure. We are also shocked and disturbed that in order to impose a candidate, the name of the President the name of President Muhammadu Buhari is being dragged into the agenda of a few under the guise of a vague term presidency. It must be clear that President Buhari has not shown any sign of supporting any project that undermines participatory democracy. Just recently, he openly stated that the electorate in states where supplementary elections are held are wiser now and should make their choice. Also during the APC primaries, we are aware Contrary to APC National work, Working Committee threats, the president encouraged aggrieved aspirants to approach the court for redress and disagree with the party on its own democratic stand then. Therefore, the ninth Senate should go ahead and elect for itself a Senate president that will work for it and for Nigerians. This position shall be communicated to all appropriate quarters, especially the Senate elect, Senate, el, senators elect, President Momodou Buhari, and all major political parties. Gentlemen of the press, this conversation will continue, will continue exploring issues in the legislative agenda for the Nine National Assembly, like the issue of the speakership, the electoral reform that has become so seriously needed, the petroleum industry bill that is still hanging in the National Assembly, and other important bills that will help strengthen governance in Nigeria. Plans shall be partnering with media and other stakeholders in discussing issues that must deepen our democracy legislatively. Once again, we thank you for coming. Thank you so much for watching Bookie O TV. Do not forget to comment below, share this video, and click on that subscribe button. And remember to tap the notification bell.